Thanks, Bob. Just days after many were supposed to file their taxes, we spoke with the Brazos County Democratic Party and the county's tax office about two divisive propositions on the ballot this May. KX's William Johnson has our story. A longtime resident of College Station, Amy Algie, has been paying property taxes for a while, and with the growth, she says the cost of living has continued to rise. Personally, I've seen it increase, uh, but one of the things, of my standpoint anyways, is I don't mind paying property taxes. But on May 7th, Algie says there could be change with two state propositions on the ballot that both deal with lowering property taxes. But she says school districts would bear the cost. One of the most important things we could do for our country is have an educated populace, so I'm happy to pay them if that's where it goes. Prop 1 would make adjustments to the ceilings or caps those who are 65 and over or are disabled pay on taxes. Prop 2, if passed, would decrease the amount of money homeowners pay on property taxes in relation to the market value of their property if the owner has a homestead, something that Algie says would cause setbacks for educators. We also spoke with the Brazos County Tax Office who says that although these propositions could make adjustments to a lot of people, not a lot of people are asking enough questions. Christine Rowe, the spokesperson for the county's tax office, says with Prop 2, the increase in how much a person could deduct from their property value could jump from 25 to 40,000. If it's increased to 40,000 and your property is worth $100,000, we're only going to tax $60,000 worth of value. So obviously it's just going to automatically be less. Rose says it's important to understand the tax benefits before coming to a decision. If you uh, have a house, a home where you live, not just a business owner or something like that, really look at them consider whether it's going to benefit you or not. But regardless of which position people take, Algie says it's just important to remember there's an election in May. Everybody should be looking at them and uh, just be aware because it's going to affect all of our lives in the future. And that there are issues that could affect the state on the table. Rose says if you'd like to see if you have a homestead on your property, go to Brazostax.org.